Hi, it's Therese from Lost in Paper and I'm back for the Alleyway Stamps and today I'm going to be using this really sweet ice cream from Brain Freeze and I want to alter the image, I want to make it look like the ice cream's actually been dropped so to do that I'm only going to partially stamp the image and I have a post-it note with the sticky side facing up and then just roughly working out which way my ice cream's ice cream is going to be on the card and then pick up the post-it note on top of the actual stamp then I can add my ink this is a memento tuxedo black and then just want to make sure that I remove my mask before I stamp so once I've stamped my image then I just got a pencil and drew in you know the bottom of the ice cream and then took my Copic multi-liner this is a 0.5 and I just add a few little drips of ice cream these come in the same set as well and then before I start coloring I'll just make sure that I remove any of the pencil marks with with an eraser Today I'm going to be colouring with my Prismacolor pencils and I'm going to do some really simple colouring and blending with my Gamsol and if you want to know what colours I've used they'll be listed over at my blog and the link will be in the YouTube description below and once that's all done I'll be right back with you So what I'm showing you here is that the bottom of my ice cream is actually crooked with the base of my card. I didn't notice that when I was drawing it. But to fix it, what I have done is actually cut down the card. It was going to be one layer so that the ice cream is now straight. But that meant that I had to cut the whole thing down. And what I decided then was I thought it looked really pretty with a green card base and this is an American Crafts card stock called Mint and I'm just using my stamp runner to apply some dry adhesive to the front of my card and for my sentiment I have the got a bug set and I'm using the need a hug <laughs> I thought if I drop my ice cream I know I'd need a hug I just love ice cream and I'm loving salted caramel ice cream at the moment I don't know I used to be a vanilla girl but now it's salted caramel but I've decided to go with the um, Bossed White Sentiment on black again I know I'm doing it again but I just really like the way that it pops and for a clean and simple card I thought it would work perfectly and I've just used some black foam dimensionals there to pop that up because I've gone past the whole one layer thing anyway and to add a bit of shimmer and shine I have my Wink of Stella 
I'll just see if I can catch a little bit of that shine in the light. So thanks for joining me today. I've had heaps of fun. Till next time, happy paper crafting. Bye.